Hello, folks. Well, we've got Tamworth Racing today, and it is the 24th of July, uh, 2020. And in this race, race four, we're live, and uh, Lord Riggs has gone for um, the second favourite in this event, which is uh, Cassie's sister. And we're suggesting 20 the win, 180 the place. And um, she's currently... Being number one, she's $4.40 on the uh, fixed odds, $5.60 on the tote in New South Wales. And the favourite that will be very hard to beat is the uh, is the number five. So um, that's cool missile. And uh, I personally can't see uh, my tip beating cool missile. But coming second or third, the place... Uh, tote should be about a dollar eighty, or it might even be two dollars. So, um, a hundred and eighty the plays on that, you could double your money. You see, and you only lose twenty dollars uh, on the win. Anyway, that's the theory of uh, fantasy flutters, because in reality, I've not had a wager at all. But uh, this is a uh, a very special interest uh, of mine, and it's a way of educating uh, problem gamblers, winning them off heavy betting and on to um, virtual investments, what I call equine investments. And uh, let's just see how they go. They're about to jump in about 50 seconds. This is race four at Tamworth today, Friday, July 24, uh, 2020. And there's about $4,000 in the pool, not very much, but it's better than a poke in the eye with a blunt stick. So let's see how the races run. Now, the horse I've selected is number one, Cassie's sister. And uh, it's come back from a spell and it did no good. So I'm, I, I'm feeling that second run from a spell, it might be a lot better. That's why I wasn't confident to tip it as a winner, but I'm predicting it'll come second or third. Others uh, that'll be hard to beat, a luck in running, and um, Geo Time will, will, will run a bold race too. That's number eight. Ducal number six will be in the finish too. I think there'll be about a length, a length and a half between first and fourth in this race. So let's see how they go as we cross now to uh, the broadcaster of the event, and he's he's very good too. Let's see how it goes. They're about to jump. Get a bit of volume. Two up about to come up, so that would leave artistic license and luck in running uh, to join the line. 11 to run at the 1200 metres. Thank you, Mark. And... Uh, the favourite here is Cool Missile, $2.50 for Andrew Gibbons. They're all locked away at the 1,200 metre standby. Oops. So Mickey here we Gaz go. And uh, Gav downstairs. Cassie's sister. They're off so to your time best to begin. That's a perfect dispatch. Getting away quickly, Spanish Missile, none better than Cool Missile. Texas Tycoon got away quickly. Out wide, Cassie's sister hunts forward. On the inside is Ducal, then followed by two up out wide as they settle into stride. Geo time comes around on the inside. Artistic Coming second at the moment. The widest runner then followed two up. It's drifting back. It's lost its place early as they work down the back, then followed Ducal, and last of all, luck in running. The leader on the inside, Cool Missile. Artistic license wants to go faster. It races around to Cool Missile and the other one there, Cassie's sister. Spanish Missile is back to running third, followed by Ducal on the inside, on the outside. Uh, no dreams or hope is making a move. Three wide coming to the home term. Texas Tycoon behind them, then followed further back by Luck in Running. Spanish Missile behind them. Uh, further back there as they head of the home straight is Geo Cassie's Time. Sister. At the 300 metre, or the 200 metre point now. And the leader, Cool Missile. On the outside, Cassie's sister in the centre, Artistic Licence. 
Jones. Then this followed is live. by the Duke Carl Cool Missile on the outside. Here Cassie's comes Cassie's sister. sister. Cool Missile, Cassie's sister. Oh, Got it's tight again. Shoot I reckon him. Cassie's One sister easy. has just beaten Cool Missile. One bolted in by a nostril. One. Then followed by Spanish Missile. So that Lord Riggs best next. value. Luck in running, never a hope. Followed by Got up. Duke Carl Geo. Time so we doubled the money. By two up, never Virtually. No dreams or hope. Has finished back with the tail enders. Uh, also, Texas Tycoon. And what was the other one there? White Eagle. I knew it would be a close uh, finish. And also, Luck in Running. <laughs> this is desperately close. So maybe the outside, Gaz, Cassie's sister. Yeah. Uh, the outside typically has I like the advantage Gavin. here. The cool missile don't give up yet. But we shit him. We bolted him. Yeah, I'd lean outside. We bolted yeah. him. Cassie's sister, back to her best today. Yeah, Set outside Gary's right. Are. Back to her best today. Think Gary Harley. Cool missile, but she has. Well, yeah, she we both right. worked yeah. on the Greyhound Recorder, uh, Gary Harley and I, but well, different times. I wasn't there when he was there. I was there before him. Barry Crawford, Tony Squires, a lot of pressure on. Uh, and later on, John Marnie. But she fought back. She was game, but the winner was too good by a nose on the line. When she's out of top, Cassie's sister, she is a lot better than that field. Let's this see what the, the dividends are. She's at with Troy O'Neill. You have said she'd been with Stephen Jones. $4.20. And but she can go. And, and a dollar seventy. Uh, head in it. In so, just ahead $84, $64 profit for the win, and $180 times, well, 70%, 70% of $180, bucks. 126 for the place, 126 well, pretty good. So the two hundred dollars take, and you win two hundred dollars. The so there you go. Maiden handicap over twelve hundred meters. I should have shut them up when I'm talking, shouldn't I? <laughs> anyway, that's Lord Riggs' best value uh, tips. And if you want to check out my website to uh, sign up for a an annual package, it's only six dollars a week or um, twenty two cents a race to follow my tips. And the thing is that uh, for $240 a year, you get um, my tips on a Friday sent to your email inbox or your um, phone's um, SMS texts. And I send them to you Friday night. And they're for Sydney, Melbourne and Brisbane for the weekend. And uh, so you get about 27 races. And... Um, there are other packages available too if you want to have some tips sent to you through the week, um, which would be $480 a year. Um, but I don't do any more than that. I I, um, I believe Wednesdays and Saturdays are the, uh, the best days to uh, have a little flutter and uh, keep it modest. Like what, one of my happy clients... Um, Today I, I sent him a suggestion that for $5 he takes my tips for, for Tamworth today just for the place for $5. And if they all came a place, that would be $40,000. So that's a way we can help heavy gamblers uh, wean themselves off and just have $5 or $10 and just have something on a parlay and hopefully they'll all come a place. Now, it's not going to happen all the time, but it only if it only happens once a year, forty grand for ten dollars. Lord Riggs will show you how it's done.